Hey guys, welcome to another one time review. Today I'm going to try this Boston Market, it's a new, it says it's new, um, slow cooked beef bowl with seasoned red potatoes. It is tender slow cooked meat, uh, beef and herb seasoned red potatoes and vegetables in a home style gravy. It kind of looks like a vegetable beef soup is what it looks like or a stew. Now we bought these at um, Meyer for $2.29, so that's not too bad at all. $2.29 for meals pretty cheap. It's 320 calories for the bowl, so it's, it's pretty low. There's your other information for you. Um, does not have oven direction, so microwave oven, you uh, peel back the film to vent, cook for three minutes, stir completely and recover, and then cook again for another two and a half minutes, and then let it sit for a minute or two to let it finish cooking and all that good stuff. Um, it does have a pull tab right here. Cool tab just make it easy to open. Not that that one worked really well. It's kind of weird. Okay, so there it is. It's quite a bit of stuff in there. You get looks like you get quite a bit of beef in there. I see. I see some pieces over here and a couple pieces on top. So I'm gonna vent this. Let's pull this. It's a huge piece of plastic. I'm gonna pull this plastic up to vent it and get it in the microwave. And I'll be back when it comes out. Okay, right, here it is. Oh, microwave. And um, like I said, it's like a almost like a soup. It's not quite as thin as a soup, but it's uh, looks pretty good. It's got lots of uh, lots of juice in there, lots of gravy and green beans and carrots and potatoes. So I let this cool off a bit. You know, I'm supposed to let it sit for a minute or two anyway. So that's what I'm gonna do, and I'll be back. Okay, right, gave it some time to cool off. Um, here's the bite I'm gonna take. It's got potatoes, carrots, meat, um, green beans, the, the sauce, of course. It's got a little bit of everything. Got some onion too. That's good. The potatoes are um they're a little firm. They're not um not quite as sauce as I would have liked them. That one was. But the other one I got wasn't. Who who knows? I guess it just depends on the potato you get. There's uh, tons of beef in this though. The green beans, if you're wondering, you know, I'm a, I'm picky about the green beans. They seem to be pretty decently cooked. They're not uh, really mushy, but they're not really crunchy either. They still have some crunch though. So if you if you like the more um, like the blanched vegetables, they still have some crunch to them. They haven't been cooked away to, to where they're really mushy. Same with the carrots. The carrots have a, um, a crunchy texture too. So for me, I wish they cooked. They wish they were cooked a little bit more. But I know a lot of people like them like that. Um, I like mine cooked to death. But um, if you like that crunchy, then they're fine. They're not bad. I can still eat them. And they, and they actually go really good with the meal. Yeah, you still get that crunch of the vegetables. So it's pretty good. The flavors are good. I'm trying a piece of just the beef by itself. It's like a, um, it's like a roast, like a, a piece of beef, that, uh, like a roast beef. Not like a roast beef like at Arby's, but a roast um, that you would cook at home in like a crock pot. Yeah, it's very, very tender. Tons of flavor in there, actually. Um, I love the flavor of the broth. It, it really does remind me of like a beef stew. Um, if you've ever had like Denny Moore beef stew, it's kind of like that. It's not quite as thick, but it, the flavors are very similar. Um, I like it actually quite a bit. The, um, the broth is really, really good. So um, I'm going to give this one... I'm gonna knock it half just because of the vegetables. I personally wish they were cooked a little bit more, so I'm gonna give it a four and a half out of five. Um, I would have given it a five if the vegetables had been just a little more tender and not quite as crunchy. If you don't mind the crunchy vegetables and the potatoes are a little underdone, um, then you'll be fine with this. But I'm gonna give it a four and a half just because of the vegetables. Wish they were cooked just a little bit more to give them a, a softer texture. But beyond that, flavors are really, really good. You get plenty of beef in here. Um, and it, the pieces of beef you get, um, if you cut them up into smaller pieces uh, and they break with just a spoon, um, if you break them into smaller pieces, you'll get a piece of beef in every single bite. So it's, so it's a good amount of beef. Um, and the flavors are just excellent. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll catch you next time.